Oh my gosh, wait until you see this. Look at all of this. <laughs> There is just too much beauty. These window boxes have been giving me life. I need to come and prune. I'll do that tomorrow. I'm just loving them. We got our grapes are popping up. Trying to get some watering on here. They just started to come alive. I need to finish planting here, but that's okay. And everything is starting to come alive. My apple tree isn't sprouted yet, but look at that. Oh my gosh. It is ridiculous that all of these, look at all of this. This is full of sweet peas and I did not plant not a single one. It's all volunteers. Oh my gosh. Ah, this fruit tree is starting to come alive. This one already bloomed. Peaches. I think that's a nectarine. This is a apricot. Oh goodness, we got apricots. Oh, look, 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 look. There's tons of apricots. Ah, <laughs> And this bed that I have been so lovingly trying to take care of since fall is coming alive. Of course, there is a ton of sweet peas that I did not plant again. What are these? This is either stock or snapdragon. I don't know. I get them confused. Geraniums. My um, carnations are just really booked. They're about to explode. This salvia, oh my God, I pruned this so heavily. So I'm so excited to see how in bloom it is. This peach tree continues to be a goat. I, it has so many peaches on it, it's ridiculous. The June bugs eat them all up. I have not fertilized, I need to fertilize. I have bulbs that I planted coming up. I'm so excited. I think there are tulips, yeah. Those are tulips coming up. These sunflowers have just been the living perennial, per, <laughs> perennially. And oh my gosh, wait until you see this. Look at all of these. <laughs> oh my God, all of these ranunculus. And I even have some poppies. I had forgot. Look. OMG, oh, I just, oh my God, I just can't, I can't wait till the columbine start to come in. I pruned this tree a lot. I'm gonna prune it some more of these, um, this, and look over here. I did not plant these California poppies. Babe, come look, there is so much, so much. There is so much alive, wait till you see. Uh-oh, did you get a splinter? Something. Something. OMG. Oh, this one's starting to... Oh, you know what? We probably should have pruned this tree. Oh, no, it already... Oh, no, look. It's already... Okay, now I can prune. I can see what's dead. So, I'm a prune. I'll come out here and prune it because it's sometimes it's confusing. You don't know what, what is old wood and good wood. So we planted this. Um, we cleaned out the winter, autumn winter bed around March 16th. I think it was March 16th that Saturday. And that weekend we planted a lot. I left the celery because the celery is always a goat here and I left the shard. I probably need to harvest some of the shard because I see that one bolting. 
but we planted some tomatoes. The tomatoes are doing good. Peppers are doing good. Planted a bunch of corn and um, squash. We just had a bunch of rain. So let's see. Edward is out here for the first time. Let's see. You know how much work I've done in taking care of this bed? Like on all of my Mondays and Fridays off, I'm coming out here cleaning it. The daffodils are, are done, but the sweet peas have taken over. I'm going to just let them do their thing. I didn't even plant them, but isn't it pretty? Mm -hmm. But wait, wait, come, come, come. Wait till you see. Wait till you see. I oh, don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. I will. Wait, come look. Come look. Come over here. Very nice. Look at that. Look at Aren't they exciting? Look at all of those colors. Yeah, those are poppies. That's the poppies. Those those poppies have been trying to grow forever. Yeah, these are the ranunculus. So if we go down to the flower fields, that's what, you know, what they have. Yeah, yeah. And then come, look, we got California poppies over there. You see? And the grapes have started to come up. There's some tulips coming up over here. So there's tulips over there. And then wait, come over here. Yeah. No, that's a nectar, nectar plum. And then all of our, we even got some baby squash. Can we study these? This, yeah, 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 yeah. That's chart I was going to tell you. Our celery, we can start harvesting some of that. This shard is like literally ready. So we can like saute it if you want me to make a quiche. We could do, um, put this in. It's like a green. So this one right here is about to bolt. So we really should. What's this? That's um, uh, violas or um, pansies. I get them confused. Same thing. Violets, pansies. Got a lot of weeds and <laughs> carrots over there that are just growing wild. Babe, we need to remove, um, get this up and replace it with some bricks. Maybe we can just have the bricks delivered instead of having to load them up on the car and then bring them here. You want to see that one poppy, huh? There's a lot of weeds growing back there. Look. Yeah, isn't it pretty? Yeah, yeah it's more. those are very hard. Those are um, poppies, and they um, need some cold strati stratification. They're hard. They're very, very hard to grow. But looks like we did it. I don't know how I got them. All the cold weather. All the cold weather. And then all of our carnations. I love carnations. And I'm going to prune this back these? even more. Those are irises. Those are irises that are about to bloom. Let's see. And then this peach tree that the June bugs love. We need Lots to. Of yeah, flowers. that's going to be. Hey, I want to do a fairy garden underneath our fruit trees. So I'm going to order some stuff for fairy garden. All of these are um, sweet peas, and I did not plant any of them. But they... They're not peas. Oh, stop it. If you want peas, we can grow peas. Hey, you need to turn the sprinklers back on. It just rained. And this is a plum. Yeah, but they need um, water. Look, they're going to be so pretty. Oh, I'm going to be out here eating all that food. Uh, excuse me. We no Brussels sprouts? This no, that's a uh, um, kale tree. Kale? Yeah, uh, kale tree. Kale. Oh, stop it. Kale is good. You like collard greens. It's the same thing. Um, we got some apricots on the apricot tree. Look at this one. Look at this thing. I can't even get through this. Yeah, that's um, look at that lizard. 
That is our sweet peas, babe. Don't, don't, don't. Oh, what are you look, doing? Look at these flowers. Yeah, I know. These flowers. Yes, they're gonna. It's gonna be all a blooming flowers in a second. There's some right here. No, these are like, already blooming. Yeah. yeah, all of this is gonna Where's bloom. Oh, I know, babe. It's mixed, mixed colors. So all of the herbs that I grew here are all being smothered. Oh, yeah. Oh, look, the, um, you should go look at the um, blueberries in the back. So we got blueberries. So I started walking the other way. No, I just left the, I got to turn the water off. But we got a ton of blueberries. I mean, there are a ton. This is, we, oh, that's what I was calling you for. I need you to hook this up to some kind of sprinkler or watering system because it, I can't get a watering hose back here to even water them. And they need water. They're, you see, they're starting to burn. They have a sprinkler hose. Yeah, but it's not hooked up. I need you to hook it up. Like, I can't water back there. Just, you're going to have to split it. I, yeah, I need you to do it. I don't know how to do it. Uh, like ASAP. No stress. Like if you can do it. I, I don't know how I'm going to water those blueberries. I can't get the water hose back there. So they've been, they've been watered by rain. I can't wait till this apple tree comes to life. So, okay. Back to, oh, our roses are starting to come alive. I just love this view. <laughs> yeah, I need to prune. If you give me my scissors, I'll prune. Those are the ones that I planted in January. So party. All of the roses are starting to come back and look, this one, I haven't even fed them yet. I need to feed them. That's what I'll be doing. I'll be feeding them. Yeah, I know. That's what I told you. <laughs> you didn't hear me, sir. Yeah, lots of apricots. We gotta be on it because otherwise the birds are gonna get it before us. No, not this year. No, this year you're gonna eat them? Yeah. This year you're gonna beat them? You gotta be on it. Look, they're even down at the bottom. Yeah. Oh are. my gosh. They're, you, you see finish? last year? No, 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 no. Last year we didn't have a lot of apricots. It's every other year. Oh, look, this one is our ornamental shade tree. It's starting to get some flowers. I just love how this sunflower has been perennial. Like it literally, I don't know what variety it is. It just grew itself. And it's starting to grow. Look, it's starting to green up. I didn't even know sunflowers could do that, but I have learned. Huh? Yeah, they do. Yeah, they smell. But the carnations over here smell really good. The carnations, I just love. Oh, I just love carnations in the garden. They're so pretty. These are my daffodils. So after the daffodils are spent, you still have to let them like completely get all the chlorophyll so that the bulbs can store the energy for next year. That is either stock or snapdragon. I have, I get them confused all the time. This right here, I have been, I spent like an hour, two hours, Probably like I spent so many hours a full day cleaning up this bed and look at it right now. It's so beautiful. It's just such a good feeling to have put in so much work and to have all of this. We got to figure something out with those June bugs because they're going to start coming up. I told you we needed to get that stuff. I mean, look at how filled it is. Come on, keep looking. They're going to start coming up. Like the lizards. Where'd it go? Did it just show up? They come from the grubs. They're the grubs. Hey, lizard. Hey, friend. 
We got some lemon babies. And over here, we got a ton of spring flowers coming up. Our tea tree, our eucalyptus. We pruned it back right here, the dead, and now it is taken off. I am so happy. I mean, it. it so far it doesn't have the shape that we want, but it's okay because it's coming back alive. Look at our favorite, whatchamacallit over here, rose. All that pruning, all the pruning that I did of my lemon balm, my lemon verbena is coming back. I think that's stevia right there. My marjoram, I pruned that back, so that's coming. We got some extra, whatchamacallits, yeah, que paso? Yeah, we need to get those in. Yeah, we need to get those in. Maybe next weekend, if we can start. I'll try this week to start, um, depending. But we got these roses coming up. All of those roses. Remember all that time I took taking off all those leaves and pruning them? Now they're all starting to leaf out, and they're so healthy. Hey, Frida Kahlo. Look at how healthy they are. Oh, my gosh. They're so healthy, babe. Oh, they're so healthy. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All of them, they're really, really healthy. So all of these, we just, it, the rains, we couldn't get to it because the rains just kept raining us out every weekend. So this bed, these, these are good. I was able to get to these. The only problem with this bed is we didn't get a chance to put the cardboard and the bumper crop down to smother out the grass like what we're doing over there. So I'm gonna have to try and get that. Do we have, how many bumper crops do we have? We have some, maybe that's something else. And then we had um, our tulips. You know, I one mistake that I made was planting tulips here because they're so low that they don't grow high enough to see them over I just it was just a rookie mistake not realizing that the dirt wasn't um you know raised up high enough because they're spreading and they're doing really really good I did not plant this here but uh, it's all right no that's okay I mean the tulips can use a little bit of shade I would have had to kill the bulbs, and so I just you tied can, it. You can probably I just tied it up. Clean it up. And it doesn't hmm. need all that foliage. You no, Edward. No, you kill stuff. No, <laughs> babe. No, sorry. Love you, but no. It's such a pretty day. Look at that. No, you will not get the pruners. <laughs> He's being funny. Hey, I'm gonna call the. Um, I'm gonna call the trash people and have them pick up this old furniture that just got weathered and see if they can just, if we can just have a um, extra pickup because I'm getting tired of looking at it. Oh, let me see my, so this had all that grass growing and we tried so hard to just try to pick it up. There's just no way. So we put uh, cardboard down and we put soil on top of it. And so I'm going to plant all of this with zinnia seeds. I have them. I think we're safe to plant now. So I think I'm going to plant all of that this week. I'm going to just have a whole field of zinnias and cosmos all of this and it's going to heavily plant it because we can't plant anything too deep because we're just trying to kill all the weeds there let me see if my hydrangeas are back oh maybe 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 i don't know what this rose is here's a this little tiny thing look it's so tiny that is a lilac I don't know what this is. 
I think that's a nothing burger, but and my bay is finally this thing has been here for years it's finally getting some height on it and my lilacs here babe we have a couple of blueberries from that tiny little blueberry that we put here that my lilac is starting to bud with these blueberries this is a tiny little blueberry thing blueberry um this is emerald emerald southern high bush so planted that a few years back and it was just literally a twig so we'll see we still this area here is still in a lot of work um really really good so i'm excited i'm gonna plant all of this and this is still an uh, issue with us. <laughs> All the DG right here is growing weeds. So we gotta, I gotta plant all of this stuff here. Our fruit trees, our new fruit trees are doing good. What sayeth you, sir? Yep. Are you seeing all of our hard work that we did? Yeah pay off i know it's still a lot we still got to plant all of these roses that's one two three four five six seven eight nine one two three four five six seven eight nine nine roses plus one in the front so ten roses but we won't plant them we'll plant most of these here and then I'm going to have to... Oh, it's going to be so hard getting rid of this grass. I need to put some kind of ground cover. Oh, you know that... Thing. Huh? Do the same thing. With the cardboard? Yeah. Yeah, we can do cardboard and get some mulch. I, actually, you know what? We should just do cardboard, cardboard and get the mulch. You know, the forest floor, that would be so much easier, cheaper. Because I don't want to, yeah, let's do that. I don't, we'll probably need like a two or three shovels or whatever they call them. All right. Oh, we have some dahlias coming up over here. I'm wondering if the bunnies are eating the dahlias though. Because I have... I think that may be why we never had a lot of dahlias. Because they're coming up, which shows me that they were alive. But I think our bunnies were eating them. I don't know. I have to look up if bunnies eat dahlias. Do you guys know? Do bunnies eat dahlias? So. But dahlias are coming up. This area. Ah. Let's see if I can get this up. It's so hard for me to walk past. Oh. The leftover dahlias? Ouch. Gosh darn it. The, yeah. uh, I just don't want the, the, the seed heads. Oh, yeah. Some of them are coming, are sprouting up. Yes, sir. No, they're perennials in some areas in our area. So these flowers just continue to spread. These are the ones that you see on the, like, the side of the freeway. They love the heat. I think a, a, a fairy garden would be so them. cute right here. No, I don't mind them. They're cute. I just let them. They spread easy. So they'll see like this right here. These are the seeds. So they're gonna spread. I think this would be such a cute little fairy garden over here. What is this? I can't remember what that is. I don't know. I think that's not Queen Anne's. I planted Queen Queen Anne's lace over here. We have some hydrangeas that look like they're coming back. Oh, all those tomatoes that we planted here are doing pretty good. The ones that we planted in the herb bed. 
You're doing oh, good. Thanks. My lemon balm is looking really good too. Got some artichokes that are on a struggle bus, but at least they're trying. I can't get over how pretty that looks. That's all joy. I just love that. I know this is a rather impromptu <laughs> little garden tour, but I'm okay with it. Babe, we need to get a new, um, we need to get a new cover for this. Again, we keep, it's like we buy one, two a year. And then I need to call and have them pick up this old furniture. Hey, can we get this weed up? He's not going to want to do it. All right. I am going to enjoy my spring break. I sure am. I got so much to do. It's like perfect weather right now. It's not hot. It's not cold. There's a nice soft breeze. It is just, it's magnificent. You know what I'm going to do? Oh, I need to turn off that water. I am going to um, work on my fleece out here. We need to get those. I need to put all these, all of this blue around. I have to come and gather it up. Where do these go? These go here. Can you help me put the cushions up, babe? So that it is nice and ready for me. It's not paying me no attention. Oh my god. What am I doing? I just need to put this here so it can dry. Yeah, it needs to dry. Whew, that's heavy. Yeah. Oh, water. Whew, it's dripping. It's wet. Oh, you're just leaving it yeah, out to dry? Yeah, so it can dry. You know what we need to do is try to put those um, those like flag the, things, the huh? Yeah, we need shade out there. We need to put those flag. I already thought about it. Yeah, and we need to refinish the deck. <coughs> you know, and, uh, like sand it, and then yep. paint like sand. I'm ready. Paint. Next month. You want to do it next month? Why not? All right, I'm down. That'd be nice. It'd be really nice and put like some kind of pretty. What about the, the shade thing, the. Just do a sail. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The easiest. How are we? Pole there and there, and something over here. <laughs> Ooh, I don't want you doing it. You can hire someone else to do it. Okay. I'm just telling you. 
No, we'll hire somebody to do it. Well, I don't know how, but I'm not an expert in that. I just don't want to prevent too much sun from coming into the house. I like the sunlight coming into the house. In the summer, I'd say in the summer, their sales just take them down after the summer. Okay. If you want to make it a usable space in the summer. I do want it to be a usable space. Then just, and then at the end of summer, take down the sales and then it's back to home. Yeah. You just have to have somebody come in and tell us. Would be a good idea. Pole, pole. It's so nice out here. I don't yeah. even want to go inside. It's so oh. pretty. I feel like this side of the garden is like so nice, you know? And then as you start coming, it's like, oh, it's nice. Oh, some of this is nice. But this is going to be nice too. I'm like motivated. Some of it is nice. I shouldn't say, but over here is just perfect. Yeah. Not perfect, but it's just well, you know. But that's because of the raised beds. And it's so funny. I, I really love the concrete beds. I thought that I wouldn't like them as we, you know, came here. But I just love it. I love this view. It's just so, it's like my favorite place in the world. Look at that. It's going to be so pretty, babe, in the next the next few weeks as everything starts to wake up and come alive. It's just going to be so pretty. If my goal is to get how this looks nice like this, have it over here. You know? I'm almost wondering if we should mirror like more. No, I like the in-ground beds over there. I just love it. You know what we need to do is we need to get that um, those bricks, a pallet of bricks, so we can line the cinder blocks with bricks like we did the other house. That's what we need. Because those, um, those whatchamacallits are not it. <laughs> and I appreciate what Jeremy was trying to do, but they didn't it didn't work the um whatchamacallit the bricks would be so much better the cedar wood you know let me just pull those off all right i don't want to go inside i know where i'm gonna be tomorrow unless it's gonna rain again is it gonna rain tomorrow I love you, Spring. I really, really love you. You're so beautiful.